Well, hey there, team, and welcome back to the channel, and welcome to some of the Slawmancer. I think that's how you say it. <laughs> cool, so this is a pixel art dungeon crawler, is essentially how it positions itself, and from what I've seen, it looks pretty cool. And that's it. That's enough for me. Let's go. I want to play it. Start. All right. Should be out now in early access. Brian McCrip McCrippid. You're the man. Oh, yeah. So much strength. McRipped. Brian McRipped. Oh, my God. You're an idiot, Scarlet. Come on, one more. Oh, yeah. Right. Yeah. Look. All right. I like him. There you are. We've been waiting for you. First of all, my name is Brian. Brian McRipped. Uh, you may have heard of me. I am the champion of the kingdom. I'm in charge of keeping the people safe thanks to my incredible abilities. Oh, do we get to play this dude? I like this dude the most. I could talk about myself all day long, but we don't have much time. Strange things are happening in the graveyard of Adria... Adriat... Adria... Adriat? Uh, skeletons are coming back out of the ground and spreading terror. It is the gravedigger who has given us the mission to fight and defeat them so that he can return to work as soon as possible. However, uh, I'm facing a problem of a personal nature, which unfortunately prevents me from taking care of this quest. Ah... That's why I'm calling on great adventurers like you. The innkeeper told me that he would find me strong candidates, and I must say that I am quite surprised. Nonetheless, I only need one person for the mission. Who would like to participate? Oh, here we go. The Mighty Knight. Did you say fight? Ah, oh, well, that won't be possible. I have solid armor, but it is absolutely not enough to compensate for my weak damages and my total... In aptitude to element ma elemental magic, I would be completely useless. The mighty what? Well, okay, what's this? What are you What are you doing to my knight? You're making him a sook. Ah, uh, no, not me. I came because I was told there would be croissants. Okay, I see what's going on here. It's humor. I have so little resistance and vitality that it's ridiculous. Yes, I have a decent attack speed, but my damage is non-existent. I'm not an appropriate choice at all. Correct. Probably an elf as well. Yuck. My grandfather forced me to come, so pretend I don't exist. Yes, I can cast a spell or two. Oh, whatever. Get out of here. Let's go the night. Well, I would have preferred someone else, but we'll just have to make do with. Uh, I can see you're lacking equipment. Why don't you start by visiting the old Adam Nostris at the end of the village um, and g ask him to give you one of my old weapons and then come back to me. Oh, and pick up my protein drink on the way. Chef Jean-Pierre prepares it for me. The village is not that big, but I took the liberty of marking these two points. Marking these two points on your map. Right, okay. Got Wazda. I've got Move. Got it. Alright. Right. Oh, that's a wall. Okay. That'll get you every time. Oh, what's going on here? Gemma. Hello, sweet pea. Hello, Gemma. All right, I think we got to... Oh, how pretty is this world? I like this a lot. Look at this dude. The king. Jesus, let's leave him be. What's this black one? My brother. Skilled slaw mantisa. Mantisa. Okay. All right. Adam Nostris. Prophet of the past. Hey there, adventure. Hello. My name is Adam Nostris. Um, among many other things, I am in charge of the shrine of the champions of Ara. Uh, that is in front of you. Brian McRipp sent you, did he? I do keep his old weapons. They're very precious. He's a champion of Ara, after all. I should be able to give you something. Yes. Mmm. Let me observe you. Mmm. I see. Maybe there's... No. Yes, that's for sure. I've got the right weapon for you. It didn't belong to Brian, but I think it fits a profile as uh, atypical as yours. It's a Slorm Reaper. A weapon that reaps the Slorm out of defeated enemies. They're usually restricted to champions, but you should be fine. Bring it back to me when you're done, and good luck. All right, give me the Slorm Reaper. Hey, yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. So I can hold down. Okay, cool. Look at this dude, another Slorm Manta Visser. Jean-Pierre. I can't reach him from here. Mm, who's this? The King's Counselor. Look at all these dudes cruising around doing stuff. This is cool. All right. I have no time to waste with an adventurer. You want to steal cheese from me? Is that it? Ah, you're here for Brian's drink. I didn't have time to make it. 
But there's everything you need on the table right there. You just have to follow the instructions scrupulously. This is a brand new recipe that I received this morning. I would like to know what he thinks about it. Oh, okay, so we're going to learn how to craft protein drinks. Who are you? Slormite expert. Okay. On the table is a piece of paper that says Proton, the drink for true champions. Then comes the recipe. Pour a dose of protein and water in a flask. Shake for larger ma muscles. Add a spoonful of rat poison. Ugh, okay, yeah, that's the missing ingredient. That's what I've been missing all along. The last line looks suspicious, yet you're not a cook and you've been told to follow the instructions carefully. And Chef Jean-Pierre is not very friendly. So you follow the recipe meticulously. It's ready. Oh, okay, this is just a narrative carry-through. I thought you were going to teach me how to... How to craft or something. Uh, okay. All right. Very funny. We're about to give rat poison to the hero. Is that what's going on here? Here you go, mate. 270 more reps. This dude's hard. Ah, there you are. I see you found a weapon. Now we can get to it. Did you think about my protein shake? Here you go, mate. Extra rat poison. Poisoned. My drink. I'm dying over here. Oh. Okay. Brutal. Oh. Bro. <laughs> what happened to me? In the name of Ara, I'm completely dead. That's the end of me. My divine body. My muscles. My silky blonde hair. Just look at me. Look at me. What have I become? This is a disaster. Okay, Brian. You're dead. It's not the end of the world. You've been through other trials. It's not that bad. You just need a backup plan. Good little pep talk. Well, it's decided. You're on your own. I'm going to retire. <laughs> oh. Ah! Well, now, that's new. What happened to the others? Who knows? I didn't pick them, so they're not part of the story anymore. All right. Come on. Let's get going. The writing's not terrible. Look <laughs> at this dude. The art's great. But come on. We got to... Let's let's play the game for a change, eh? Sir Brian needs, uh, needs help. It's a disaster. All the villagers have disappeared. Help us, Sir Brian. Oh, Sir Brian's dead. This is a disaster. Sir Brian's dead. Our champion's dead. Everything is over. Well, he's still got me. So much for retirement. For lack of anything better, I think you're going to have to get us out of this mess. Let's start by going to see the king. Where the village is no longer safe. Oh, here we go. Primary skill. Time for a fight. You now have one skill. Press that to use it. All right, I've got little Brian the Sprite backing me up. Let's go. All right. Yeah, get get busted up. Nice. One sec, King. I'm busy. All right, what's up? Oh, that's options. Wait. Oh, okay. Right, so F opens options normally. Okay. My faithful Alistor, my dead Alina, or my dear Alina, gone. Ah, oh, who are you? Ah, yes, you're the adventurer. All is not lost after all. Did you see what happened? Everything was going well when suddenly a blue flash and everyone was gone. There's also this huge seal on my door and I can't get inside anymore. You're going to help me, aren't you? That's strange. I don't think he can see me. I also feel like the apparition of this mysterious seal and the disappearance of the villagers happened right after my death. Could it be that? We should take a close look at the seal. We should. Let's have a squiz. I knew it! I recognize these symbols. This is a slawmancer's seal. It can only be him. That vile scoundrel must have planned my assassination. His plan is now in motion. He knew that only a champion like me could oppose his immense powers. Oh my god, the slawmancer is back. Wait, that's his name? Oh my god. Oh my god. Alright, very cool. This humor is, uh... Well, you know what? It's not that abrasive. So, we're all good. Listen! We can hear voices behind the door. Here we go. The champion is dead and I have deprived the old king of his castle. A very slick move. All we have left to do now is take care of Alina so that I can finally get my old powers back. Yes, master. Well, well, someone is listening. I thought I made everyone disappear. And that's fine. I have other options. Oi, back up. Look at that. Life. You took a hit. Ouch. And if your life goes down to zero, you, you lose. Got it. I understand. King! What just happened? Did you touch the seal? It's so confusing. My faithful Alistor would know what to do, but we must find... We must find him. Oh, yeah, okay. I sent him on a mission 
to the harbour before the disaster. Could you find what happened to him? Yes, let's go find Alistor. Maybe he'll know what to do. All right, looks like the harbour's down south. Oh, he took an extra... What's this? A light rat. Slorm. Whenever you kill an enemy, you also reap his slorm. The essence that brought him back to life. You will eventually be able to upgrade your skills with the slorm reaped this way. Right, so it's just XP. I understand. Okay. Now what? Oh, jeez Louise! What's this about? Oh, hello, Alistor. I remember you. Well, what a strange experience. I've just seen some very weird things inside. Thanks for getting me out of there. Is the king safe? I must talk to him about my terrible discovery. Let's meet in front of the castle. Could you not, while I'm in a dialogue? Hey, look, there's a little soldier down here. Customs office. Did you see that? I didn't disappear. I don't get it. I guess I do have a purpose if I was left here. Okay. Okay, well, let's go back up to the king. Do I have, like, a character sheet? Ooh, I sort of... I do. That's cool. Reach level 10. Not enough slorm. Ah, oh, no good. Oh. Oh, there he is. Hello, Alistor. Well, my brave Alistor, what happened to you? My lord, I was on the way to the harbour when I suddenly found myself in a kind of prison made of shadows and slorm. Everything was dark and slimy. I saw all sorts of strange things, but most of all, I saw him, Kim, watching me. My lord, he was as described as in tales, sinister and terrifying. There is no possible doubt about his identity. Oh my god, the Slormancer. He's the one behind this. I suspected it. He chose the best moment to act. All is lost without the champion of Ar Ara. No one can defeat Om a god, e except Ara himself. We should flee to all legs and abandon my castle and village. Never! We must think of a plan. I have a plan. <laughs> We're going to destroy that seal and open the door and defeat Oma God. Okay, yep. Yeah. My lord, brilliant idea, but this seal, it's just not like any other seal. It is a slawmancer's seal. It is indestructible and unbreakable. You say this seal is indestructible and unbreakable? That's not a problem. I know the existence of a relic. The destroyer of indestructible and unbreakable seals. Well, that's very fortunate, isn't it? All we have to do now is go get it. My lord, brilliant idea. But like all relics, the destroyer of indestructible and unbreakable seals has been hidden in the depths of Earth. It is buried under the crypt of the McRips, Rip the McRippids, <laughs> deep inside the graveyard of uh, Adriart. I know it well, my faithful Alastor, but the graveyard is right next door. We only have to go there and dig it up to put my plan into action. But my lord, a brilliant idea, but to dig up a relic, we need a shovel. Unfortunately, Pedro the Grave Digger owns the one and only shovel of the kingdom. <laughs> and we must find Pedro in order to find his shovel, in order to dig up the destroyer of indestructible and unbreakable seals, in order to destroy the seal and defeat Oh my God. Now, I've complained about this sort of fetch questy stuff in some games before. I need to do this to to do this, to do this. The, the fact that this is being meta and being self-referential gets a pass. Absolutely. They're going to keep sending me to find something, to find something, to find Pedro, to find his shovel. I'm on board because it's winking at the camera. But, uh, my lord, brilliant idea. But who's going to do all that now that the champion's dead? Well, that young adventurer is just the person we need. Well, we should start searching the graveyard. We'll probably find Pedro there. The entrance is right next to my shack. Right. Let's go then. So we don't seem to be healing, you know? I don't... I mean, we'll figure it out. The game will teach us. Have faith. Pay respect. All these workout sessions to end up in the mud. Yeah, it's a bit rough. Oh, I guess that's where we all end up in the end. Oh, wow. Look at this map. Yes. Recommended level one. Yes. Building graveyards, so it's procedural, presumably. Come on, let's get to Pedro the Grave Dig. It could be dangerous. Yes. Yes. What is this? Chainmail Greaves. 
Hook a boy up. Yes. Uh, you have found a piece of equipment. Open it by pressing I. Here we go. New Slorm Reaper found. Adam Nostris's sword. Yeah, 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 yeah. You can move your new equipment to corresponding slot to equip it. Light wrap. Oh. I got me shoes. Yes. 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 All right. I don't know if sh smashing any of this shit, Matt. Oh, no. There's some gold in there. Oh, they gave me a full health top up. Oh, he's leveled up, boys. Nice. Experience. You gain experience every time you slay an enemy. You've accumulated enough experience to gain a level. Much strong. Whenever you level up, you gain a character attribute point. Press T to use it. All right. Character traits menu from here. You can use your newly acquired points. No worries. You can undo and change your layout at any time for free. Fantastic. That's how all games should be. I never understood people that railed against that because if, if you just got such a problem, just don't reset them. Just don't press the reset button. It's like it's almost like people want to tell other people how to play games. Um, now what's this? Oh, this music's wonderful. Toughness. Savagery. Plus raw damage. Oh. Fury, yes. Plus evasion. Plus critical chance. Plus armor pin. Melee recast chance. What is that? Projectile dance. Oh, that might... That... See, that feels like a barbarian tree. Determination, zeal. I like all these names of these trees. Bravery. That's pretty cool as well. Slorm find. Savagery. Raw damage. Just, just raw damage. Yes. But this is like evasion. So that's, yeah, okay. No, I want this. Give me that. Oh my God. Oh, here we go. You get a greater trait. Yes. Oh, yes. Okay. This, I am into this. I'm two hitting these blokes now. So good. All right. Are we going to have to press inventory every time? Right click to equip. Hey, there we go. Nice. Oh, not quite. Splintered belt. Inventory. Let's not overthink it just yet. Yes. Combat's simple enough at the moment. Here we go, right on time. Got an archer to change things up a bit. Okay. Very much follow the bouncing ball, but that could just be this mission. You know, like, there's just one path to take by the look of it. Mythic foot pads. Whatever, I don't care at the moment. Nice. Let's go, buddy. I'm, I'm, you know what? The, this is a simple enough, simple enough for the moment. But, you know, pretty straightforward dungeon crawling experience. I'm all about this. I love dungeon crawling. Nice. Look at this. I'm the master of dodging. Oh, yeah. Give me some more. Yes. Secondary skill. You got a new skill? Skills that automatically become your secondary skill. 
Press right click to use it. Got it. What's what's it do? Secondary slot wood stick. Oi! I've got a I've got a gun. All right, hang on. What's going on here? No, we don't want that. Oh, raw damage. Yeah, maybe we do want that. Plus evasion. Yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. All right, what's this do? Pick up the closest piece of wood you can throw it. Deal skill damage. Skill damage. Okay. Character attributes. Give me more of this. Plus 300 max. Oh, this sequential. Oh, all the way up to here, I guess. More damage, more. If I'm not one tapping, I'm not I'm not strong enough. Whew. It's not bad. Nice, get out of here. Defeat most enemies. Nobody here, let's get back to the village. I can turn into a door and make our travels easier. Look, good, it doesn't need explaining. I'm all right with that. This game's good, I'm really enjoying this a lot. Enemies slain against level one enemies. Yes, yes, okay, cool. Pedro was not in the first part of the graveyard. But let's explore the next area. Oh, yes, that's a good idea. Where's the grave digger? Recommended level two. Yes. Completed with. Right. Okay. So it's keeping track. Oh, man. Don't get me wrong. Love roguelikes. Look, it feels like that Um, maybe the, the, the dungeon crawler of, of yore has been, of yesteryear, has been sort of left by the wayside, you know? Like, action dungeon crawler, right? Like, not an RPG or anything. I can combo them to attack faster. Oh, okay. Some stuff going on here now. Look at this. Now we're zipping along. I'm just holding down both mouse buttons, pretty much. I like the music. It's very dinky. Very, it's very appropriate. Oh, you shot me! You shot me in the arm! Hey, 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 hey! Oh, what's going on here? Max mana, thorn damage. Don't need thorns if you don't get hit. Plus armor, plus no. Let's know. T. Let's go. We're starting to steamroll a bit now. Now where do I go? Down there we reckon? Okay. Ow. Wait, can 
Can I get through there? Yeah, didn't I already come from here? Are here? Yep, okay. Mighty Swing Mastery 2. Yeah, let's go. Mastery. Your skills are going mastery level. has become more powerful and upgrades are now available. Open the skill menu by pressing C. All right, let's go. Upgrades, you can invest in an unlock and an upgrade. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, got it. Well, what do they do? Oh, hang on. And there's an initial plus 1% crit chance. That's pretty cool. Enemies hit by the Mighty Swing are dazed. That's cool too. Mighty Swing is a 6% chance to skewer. What does that do? Give me that. Invest. More. More, 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 more. Yes. So I guess I could... Oh, I can get mastery of my stick. Right, and they're the other mastery levels. All oh, right, here we go. I... Mm, yes, this is good. Mana. If you fall short on mana, you'll be able to cast skills. Yeah, okay, but I don't I don't need mana. Now this spawned a bunch of blokes last time. Oh right, and the room's been locked. Nice, who's this? Oh, it's Pedro! You found a villager that was trapped inside the breach. He'll make his way back to Adriat on his own, and you'll be able to talk to him once you get out. Nice. Saw something very strange in there. Thank you for getting me out of there. It was a weird experience. What? You need a shovel? You've come to the right person. I have a great shovel. But let's get back to the village first. You go ahead and I'll meet you there. All right. Let's go. Head home. Victory! Nice. I'm thankful for you getting me back. You're looking for a shovel, aren't you? Well, I have one. It's a very special shovel. It's useful to dig holes, but not only that... Thanks to brilliant modifications, my shovel is able to point north. I call it the shovel compass, and I really care about it. But I lost it. Or should I say I abandoned it? I was digging one of my most beautiful holes with it, a hole that wasn't too deep nor too irregular, when monsters started coming up around me. <laughs> so naturally, I fled with all my legs, abandoning my shovel compass to its fate. <laughs> You're going to get it, aren't you? Uh, it shouldn't be too far from where you found me. Let's go get that shovel compass. Yes, we should. This is cool. This game is great. The humor is a bit bonkers, but I it's it's tickling me, right? It's getting giggles out of me against my better judgment. <laughs> this dude talking about the oh, not too deep and not too shallow, just the right depth of hole that I was digging. Yeah, all right, mate. <laughs> <laughs> this is good. I like it. And the dungeon crawling aspect's a lot of fun, man. Like, it feels like something that's been sort of forgotten in recent times. Um, and it's kind of good to see this back. Like, I, I don't want to take away from what this game's doing. It's doing so well. Well, the sum of its parts, for sure. It's just really strong. But what it's also doing has been done before. You know, an action adventure dungeon crawler with very light RPG mechanics. We've seen this many times before, but I guess we just haven't really seen it in recent times. And it's kind of refreshing, to be perfectly honest. Anyway, let me know what you reckon if you want to see some more. We'll play some more for sure. Uh, otherwise, I might just leave it there for the time being, and I'll catch you guys on the next one.